Hey, what's up everyone? So welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna show you the fix for the bug that you can't update to a newer build. Uh, I have already the newer build, it says last checked yesterday, uh, but I have now the build uh, with the number uh, 55 and the problem was on the build 51, the OS it couldn't install the build 51. I made here some screenshots, here was the screenshots when I was trying to update. And even if I were I was pressing on the download button, it was staying always on the zero percentage. It was saying downloading zero percent, and then saying again this one. It was like this in this loop. And even when appeared this newer build 55, I couldn't download this newer build because it was always saying this. So the fix to that, there is some fixes on on the internet already, uh, but they are so complicated which I didn't follow what they were what they were saying I mean only a bit but you don't need to do all what they are saying and the fix to for that is you just need to go in time and language go into time come on set date and time uh, to automatically turn it off and here for example now it's October 28th choose seven days in the future so one two three four five six seven so press yes and then you can restart your phone but I just did that I went I went back I went back checked the, uh, the updates and it was already checking for updates but it was taking so much time that I restarted the phone and uh, after restarting the phone I got then this picture um, which was uh, updates are available and I pressed downloading I press download and it started to download and this is the fix you don't, you don't need to do what others were saying that you need to go change uh, the, the time to seven days in the future uh, then you need to go into network uh, go into airplane mode then turn on to turn on airplane mode turn off airplane mode do some there was like 10 uh, steps to follow which were so so complicated but I just did that with seven days in the future and it got fixed and I installed it as, as you can see I have the latest build because I still saw people saying that <laughs> they are stuck on that bug and they can't install the newer build so um, I'm doing this video to show you that to just do this easy trick if, you'll, if it will not work this easy trick for you because yeah of course it might not work for everyone uh, then follow the steps that other people said from, for example, like Windows Central, all these big blogs, uh, they, they were saying how to fix that. But that's way too complicated and this worked for me, it's easy steps and that's nice. And this build actually, it's pretty smooth, but uh, TubeCast for me doesn't work anymore. Uh, it actually, these TubeCasts happened from the previous build as well but it's still on this build i just i uninstalled it i moved to sd card i moved to internal memory still same tries to open stays black and then just crashes if someone fixed already tubecast let me know because um, tubecast is my favorite uh, youtube application and at the time i use my tube beta because it's the new design but in the, but in the my tube beta i can't uh, comment so <laughs> that's kind of lame uh, but how it's a better, of course, no problem. And in this build, <laughs> remember when I previously showed you that uh, update update apps automatically uh, and uh, streaming uh, streamlined my purchase experience wasn't working. So even this was always on. If I was turning off, closing the store, restarting the phone, whatever, it was always staying on. And I couldn't see whenever I got a new update. So now you can turn it off. And as you can see, it says that I have. Uh, updates i know this is kind of a lame bug because i mean or not like a big improvement but for some people who like to go every day into the store and check for updates that's pretty cool and as you can see um here is my clock at the starting of the of this video the clock was working and now it's <laughs> doesn't work anymore i i saw that in this build happens this pretty often so you see again now it works I just needed to turn off and turn on again it, and it works uh, but this is only like only problem that I see in this build which is the, the clock is not really a, a major problem for me but the tube cast doesn't work 
uh, and that's more or less that's it. And the bug for the processor for eating so much battery, it got fixed on the previous build, on the 51, but many people couldn't install it. And in this build it also works pretty well. Uh, I can't really complain about the battery, uh, but my phone, like I said, even on the previous build when the problem of the processor was there, uh, I couldn't really feel it that it was heating up because this device doesn't really heat up, but overall the battery is more than fine. I'm not I'm not gonna do now a review of this uh, build because uh, I mean it doesn't bring any new features and only like some, some bug fixes, but this video was mostly to show how to fix that problem and as you can see here the clock again I need to turn it off and turn it on and let's see if it will work now. And, uh, yeah, it's for now it works, <laughs> but other than that problem and the tube cast, it works more than fine. Uh, and this is the fix for the problem to getting stuck on the previous build. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and let me know if you found any fix for the tube cast and if you couldn't install this uh, build. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys for watching.